both John Stewart and Isaiah Crowell have signed with their teams. So John Stewart has signed with the New York Giants. There's really no specification on the deal. It looks like it will probably be a one-year deal since he is a 32-year-old running back. And then you got Isaiah Crowell, who signed a three-year deal with the New York Jets, and he he's 25 years old, so he definitely has some um, age left in him, plenty of age left in him. But when it comes to it, I'm going to start with John Stewart. John Stewart, obviously, he's a veteran running back, and when it comes to the Panthers, it really felt as if that for a while they really underused John Stewart for a little while. He's not a great running back, and he's definitely not the same explosive threat they used to be. However, though, he is a veteran in the running back depth chart. And that would just be good just to have a guy or a running back just know what he does out there. Because the running backs last year for the Giants had no freaking clue what they were doing. Really no veterans right there and all of that. And they really haven't had good running back play in a long time for the Giants. Uh, it's, it feels like ever since Ahmad Bradshaw has the running back play been, been comparable at that point. But uh, when it comes to... When it comes to Isaiah Crowell, he's definitely a okay running back in this league. He's definitely a home run style. He does fumble a lot. I know that gives a lot of people problems. But he has that home run style that you kind of need at the in the Jets system with the running back. Because the Jets don't really run it in on the goal line. They tend to throw it to their – they tend to throw it on the goal line a lot. Usually to some big wide receiver right here or there. But usually when it comes to it, they just need a really home run threat. And he's not a guy that's like super – super like special he's not really a thousand yard rusher even with a good old line he's just a guy just kind of bring in there just for depth just to be that home run threat who we'll, i think he might be worse with the jets simply because well he's going from having joe thomas as a left tackle and having a zeitler as a guard to really not really having that stellar of an offensive line so, obviously, these are some running back signings. I thought some other teams could pounce on him. I definitely think the Ravens need a running back right here. I, I really do. They really need something something right there because the Ravens will make the playoffs if they have a running back. If they don't, their, their offense is just not going to be good enough just to carry them through. But overall, guys, what do you guys think? I know these are kind of lame signings right here. I haven't reported on every sign. There's some signs with, like, Albert Wilson to the Dolphins and Paul Richardson to the Redskins and all of that. But hey guys, thanks for tuning in this channel. I promise you I'll get these videos in. Talk to you guys later. Peace.